everybody, my name is Vanessa B, and I'm here to tell you a little bit about the Horse Agility Club that I started just over a year ago. When we first started, we thought that it was going to be just a little local club, but it's now gone global. I thought to myself, what's going to happen if we start taking the lead rope off our horses? You see, this was the myth that I'd been sold, that horses have to have a lead rope. So, I came out into my field, made sure all the gates were closed, got my horse leading really well, went over the few simple obstacles I had then, like a tarpaulin and a few cones and a little jump, and got that really good. And then I thought, well, what's the worst that can happen? She'll run away and eat grass. So I unclipped the rope, and to my complete and utter amazement, she just stayed with me like the rope was still there, and we were away. Good girl, well done. Good girl. Good girl. The key is to get your horse leading really well on the lead rope. Then start to lead the horse through the arch of the hoop without the bottom curve. When this is solid, you can include the lower curve of the hoop at ground level so that you and the horse can easily step through the hole you have created. As you and the horse become more confident you can start to raise the lower semicircle of the hoop. Because you've got really good at leading you can take the lead rope off then start to walk and run around the outside of the hoop and encourage the horse to pass through. The horse is used to running beside you and he's used to passing through the archway. Now all you do is put it together. Once the horse knows what you need him to do, he will quickly jump through the hoop with very little instruction at all. <laughs> 